Alright everyone, so I got my Remington 870 here. Now this is a very popular shotgun, it's pretty much the most used in the United States. So lots of people have this and are buying it. When I first got it, I started taking it apart and I had some trouble putting it back together. So I wanted to make this video to show you guys how to take it apart and put it back together for cleaning. There's a few little tips that will make it real fast and easy for you. So if you're stuck on getting it back together, this should help you out. To take it apart first, I'm going to go ahead and take off the barrel. Just unscrew this uh, bolt that's holding it on. Have your uh, chamber about halfway open there so you have room to work with. And it just slides right off. That's the easy part. It's also pretty easy to take off this. All you do is inside the bottom here, which we're also going to press these uh, levers to put it back together. Inside the bottom on either side. don't know if we're going to be able to see this on camera. But on either side, one's on this side, one's up in here, there's little uh, metal pieces you can push. And those are needed to get this in and out. So first off, we're going to go ahead and get this uh, ready to pull out. There's also a little button down here which sometimes helps. But basically, you're going to want to put your finger in here. And there's going to be a little lever. And you push it. Then there should be the other side that you might have to push to. Should come off. Now I got it stuck there. There we go. Basically, just keep pushing on these little levers inside and then slide it right off. But try not to drop that stuff on your feet like I just did. So, basically, what happened is I slid it out real fast there and uh, the slider just fell off. But it just sits on here and we'll talk about how to put it back together in a second. So, these are all the parts you're going to have when you take it apart. We're not going to go ahead and take off the trigger section and all that. You don't need to take that off every time, but for cleaning you need to disassemble it at least this much. So now you can clean the barrel, you can get into everything and just make sure everything's clean and oil and oiled. So then when you're ready to put it back together, go ahead and take this and we're going to put our pieces back together here. These just fit. And then you're going to want the side with the little hole, not the side with the button, to be facing towards the front of the gun. So you take the slider here, put this on there, this on here, and now I have this backwards. I want this towards the front of the gun, which it is actually. So now, go ahead and just slide this back on. Now this is the tricky part. You get to here, you can't go in anymore. What you have to do now is there's going to be these little buttons up in here. And you push the one on the right side of the gun first, then the left side of the gun. So right now we're going to go in, push a little button in here, and it should make a clicking noise. Hear that click? Now it's going to move down just a little bit. It moved like that much farther down. You might not have even seen it, but I could feel it move a little bit down. Now we're going to push on the opposite side. There's another one of those. Hear that click? And then it'll slide right in. And it's functional again. So then all you have left to do is put on your barrel. And it's real simple. You just slide it on. Line it up. And it should slide on pretty easily there. And then just put back on your nut, your bolt here. Don't tighten it too much. You want to just get it hand tight. Don't go cranking it too hard or it'll be really hard to get off. And just like that, your gun is fully ready to go again. So I just wanted to show that. It's real simple to do, but unless you know these little things, it's kind of a pain and the manual doesn't really tell you. So that's how to disassemble and reassemble the Remington 870 for cleaning. If you have any questions, let me know. See you guys later.